Annually, World Hand Hygiene Day is observed on May 5th. The theme for this year's campaign is promoting knowledge and capacity building of healthcare workers through innovative and impactful training and education on infection prevention and control, including hand hygiene. The slogan for this year's observance is, why is sharing knowledge about hand hygiene still so important? Because it helps stop the spread of harmful germs in healthcare. This simple act can prevent the spread of germs, including those resistant to antibiotics. If done correctly, it is the most effective and cost-efficient intervention that can be implemented in the healthcare setting. Some healthcare workers may need to wash their hands as many as 100 times during a work shift. Contaminated hands of healthcare providers are the primary source of pathogenic spread. Proper hand hygiene decreases proliferation of microorganisms, thus reducing infection risk and overall healthcare cost and length of stays, thereby improving health outcomes. According to the World Health Organization, this will be achieved by strengthening learning approaches to enable implementation of innovative and effective training to empower healthcare workers to improve hand hygiene and infection prevention and control practices at point of care. Furthermore, this can be achieved by promoting access to innovative hand hygiene and IPC training resources raising awareness about the importance of knowledge, learning on hand hygiene at the right time to prevent a range of infectious diseases, encouraging measurement and evaluation mechanisms to assess the impact of training and education on IPC standards and practices, including hand hygiene. It is vital that all healthcare facilities, both public and private, institute measures to evaluate and strengthen IPC measures, as well as providing continuous and consistent capacity building opportunities for healthcare workers. While this year's theme targets healthcare workers, extending it to the entire population is just as important. The critical importance of hand hygiene was highlighted during the COVID-19 pandemic and is still very effective in preventing infectious diseases spread from one person to another by contaminated hands, such as gastroenteritis, influenza, colds, and COVID-19. The Ministry of Health, Wellness, and Elderly Affairs will be conducting interactive educational sessions on hand hygiene throughout the month of May at wellness centers, as well as primary schools, small businesses, and constituency councils. Training sessions will also be held at all healthcare facilities for healthcare workers. Therefore, we encourage you to participate in those upcoming sessions. Protect yourself and your loved ones. Stay healthy by washing your hands often, especially during these key times when you are likely to spread germs. Before and during preparing food, before and after eating, before and after caring for someone at home who is sick with vomiting and diarrhea, before and after treating a cut or a wound, after using the toilet, after changing diapers or cleaning a child who has used the toilet, after blowing your nose, coughing or sneezing, after touching an animal, animal feed or animal waste, after handling pet or food or treats, after touching the garbage, after returning from a public facility or a health facility. Washing hands with soap and water is the best way, but if not available, you can use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer that contains at least 60% alcohol. Remember, hand hygiene is the single most important way to reduce risk, interrupt infection, and even prevent hospitalization. Clean hands saves lives. Thank you.